emotional announcement, Princess Catherine has taken the world by storm with her recent public statement, expressing her profound gratitude towards her husband, Prince William, and the unwavering support of the entire royal family. During her ongoing health battle, the princess, known for her poise and grace and dedication to public service, has been quietly facing a personal challenge that has shaken the very foundation of the monarchy. Royal fans were also left sobbing for joy as they sent their support to her latest update in her cancer journey. As well as well-wishers online have responded in thousands to congratulate the mother of three and hope for a full recovery in the coming months. Emotional cancer sufferers have praised Catherine's vulnerability as they shared their stories and experiences of the deadly illness. One person wrote, As a breast cancer survivor, this really got to me. I'm two years out from my own treatment's end, and I am with you. Thank you for being such a light in the world amidst your own pain. Live each day and take the blessing of the loved ones to heart, praying for all those suffering from cancer and praying for the strength of their loved ones. Cancer charities were also quick to welcome the news and praise the princess's openness. A spokesperson for Macmillan Cancer Support said, We're grateful to the princess for being so open about her experience, as this will no doubt give hope to many others going through similar experiences, and encourage more open conversations about the impact cancer can have on people's lives. Dame Laura Lee, CEO of Maggie's, added, It'll benefit too many people living with cancer to see her come through this treatment and share this video. Indeed, the outpouring of support from the public has been truly remarkable. Fans from all corners of the United Kingdom and beyond have rallied behind the princess, flooding social media with messages of love, hope, and encouragement. These heartfelt sentiments have not gone unnoticed, as the princess herself has expressed a deep gratitude for the outpouring of kindness and support. Celebrities turn out in force to send their well wishes to the royals as they held her inspirational. One such star is actress Olivia Munn, who opened up about her own battle with the disease, having been diagnosed with breast cancer in 2023. Amanda Holden also shared her admiration for Catherine as she commented, I'm sobbing. This is beautiful. Meanwhile, on X, formerly Twitter, news anchor Carrie Lake said, What a beautiful message and a wonderful update. Former U.S. Treasury Secretary Monica Crowley added, The best news, sending prayers from America for your continued full recovery. Kelly Hoppen, a South African British furniture designer, also said, My heart is full watching this wonderful film and knowing you're now on the road to recovery side by side with your loving family. Prime Minister Sir Keir Starmer wrote on social media, Pleased to hear the Princess of Wales has finished chemotherapy. On behalf of our entire country, I send her my best wishes for a full recovery. Even BBC arts and media correspondent David Salito has tonight compared her move to the behavior of American pop star Beyonce in a remark that has puzzled viewers. If you take someone like Beyonce, she's barely said a word to the media in the last 11 years because she doesn't need to because she can talk directly. I think this is the princess talking directly and choosing both how and what she'll say about something that's difficult and painful. The personal video message was released at 4.30 p.m. and showed a video of the princess and her family. The personal video message was released at 4.30 p.m. and showed a video of the princess and her family as she spoke in the background about her cancer journey. The information was released both nationally and internationally, roughly an hour before the announcement. This is a common practice for the royal as it allows news organizations to prepare coverage in advance for the official announcement to the public, to ensure accurate and sensitive reporting of major matters. Editors and their reporters quickly received a media package containing all the information they would have required to adequately prepare ahead of time. Announcements like this are few and far between. But both Charles and Catherine have this year shared updates with the public about surgeries and diagnosis they have both received. 